Hey everybody, Steven here, and today I am checking out Valheim. I know a lot of people are playing this right now, huge buzz around this game. I wasn't sure if I was going to do it, but I uh, wanted to hop in. One of the reasons for that is I didn't realize Copystain Studios is, I think they're the ones that are publishing this. So Copystain is the game studio that is doing Satisfactory, so... It, it piqued my interest more with this, and so far right off the bat, I am digging the music, but uh, let's get into this. <clears throat> Alright, select character. My guy's invisible. New. There we go. The graphics are pretty gnarly. Reminds me of like early World of Warcraft. Let's go dark, dark. Can I turn him? It's whoa. <laughs> Got some emu. Emu, emo. Emo looks. Emu is the animal, right? I can't even see that ponytail. How do you. Oh, I'm digging the beard. Ooh. What? That's pretty gnarly. I'm really digging that. I want to see the ponytail, though, because I can't see how long it is. I may just go with this braided look. I'm uh, kind of digging the long, too, though. I think I'm gonna go with the long. There it is. Hair tone. Oh, there we go. I can move the guy. Is that red? White. Kinda digging that red. Blondness? Whoa. All the way black. That kinda looks... Can't tell with the fire. <laughs> Let's go there. Um, <clears throat> let's see, what name do we want? All right, I'm gonna be super lame. My guy's Gandalf. Gandalf, don't play. All right. Whoa. <clears throat> we got Middle Earth. All right. All right, here we go. Valheim. Is not going to read it. Long ago, the Allfather Odin united the worlds. He threw down his foes and cast them into the tenth world. Then split the bows that held their prison to the world tree and left it to drift, unanchored to a place of exile. For centuries, this world slumbered uneasily, but it did not die. As glacial ages passed, kingdoms rose and fell out of sight of the gods. When Odin heard his enemies were growing once again in strength, he looked to Midgard and sent his Valkyries to scour the battlefields for the greatest of their words. Dead their world, they would be born again in Valheim. Holy smokes. Hopefully they narrate that later. Whoa. Great intro. I'm wondering what the visuals look like once the game launches. Like when it's finally done, compared to now. Saw something. Where's this dude taking me? Just gonna drop you off. Just this big bird's gonna drop you. <laughs> Hail the warrior. I'm Hugin, sent to here to guide you in your travels. The megaliths around you are the s sacrificial stones. They represent the forsaken, which you must slay in order to ascend to Valhalla. Register location. Okay.
Missing required item. Missing required item. Saying saying the same thing. Okay. These magical stones were scattered throughout the lands by Odin. Signpost point pointing towards the ritual grounds of the Forsaken. If inspected closer, this one will reveal the summoning place of Ichthyr. Ichthyr? Ichthyr. Your first prey. He is a mighty beast, so you need to properly arm yourself before even attempting to defeat him. Alright. Thanks, dude. Are you gonna... That's all you're gonna say? Whoa, that's a trip. I thought I saw it in another video I watched, but I wasn't quite sure. Like, can you go on that stuff? All right, let's get some. Can I, how do you grab stuff? Or do you punch it? Skill improved, unarmed. We're just gonna take our skill, there you go. Torch, rag tunic, something else. Just punching trees. There you go. Resin torch. Skill improved. Dang. Get some foods. That guy's saying something. You have found a snack. Consume it to improve your health and stamina. Be aware that before long you will grow hungry again, so try to always have at least a couple different meals ready. <clears throat> Kick this tree. Boom. And it did no damage. Kick this tree. Boom. So you have to push in the scroll wheel to do that, and then left click to punch. Boom. That's the Sparta, <laughs> Sparta kick right there. All right, so tab, consume, I got it. Club, craft, there we go. So hit two, got ourselves a club. Most items must be crafted. However, due to your recent departure from Midgard, you will have to recall the true shape of objects. Just pick things up and it will all come back to you, I'm sure. My lesser brother, Munin, tells me you can one can fashion a stone axe out of wood and stone. Let's to go kill that deer, too. Hit that stone. That did nothing. All right, pick up stone. There we go. Bada boom. Oh, here's some stone. Get you and you. And you. Yeah, I saw a thing. They were saying that a lot of people were wondering what the... Ooh, Dandelion. Some of the inspiration for the game, and... I can't remember what games they were trying to point to t with this, but they said uh, Skyrim and... Uh, Zelda were big inspirations for the game and the gameplay. Oh, mo more food. So if we press M, there's our map. Gandalf Ping. What? That that way? <clears throat> Alright, let's see craft. Nope. Come over here, stone axe. I need five wood. Okay. Three hundred for my limit on stuff that I can carry. Whoa. Whoa. I didn't even see you, dude. Heck yeah. Getting some food. Breaking stuff with my stick. Alright. Whoa. What is this thing? This land is hard and wild, but we who are brought here are harder still. <laughs> that sounds weird. <laughs> <laughs> Take comfort, traveler. 
and the gifts before you, the good wood and stone, the fruits and flowers of the forest. Look also to the wild boar who roam these lands. They fear fire and the hand of men, hand of man, but they can be taught to obey it. Go quietly to them and let them eat of your stock. Roots of the ground are their pleasure. Okay. Well, you know that. But until we do that, I'm gonna beat this dude. Oh, come on. Turn around. Where are you going, dude? Get some. I'm about to die. Pretty sure my health is 12. So let's... Hold on. Uh, E. Can I eat more raspberries? Uh... Uh... I'm gonna craft that. Keep those guys away from me. Get you. Stone axe. Three. Yeah, how do you... Alright, so my health is going back up slowly, I think. Block, mouse, attack, block. Oh. Hit up that log, dude. There it is. Still not 100% sure where I'm going or what I'm doing. That looks nice over there, though. Alright, let's see you swim. Gaining skill for swimming. Wait, if he runs out, is he gonna drown? Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay. What is that thing? Where's my... Can I hit him with the hammer? Heck yeah. Where is that dude? What is that? Goblin. Do you get anything for that? They drop stuff? Doesn't look like it. Whoa. What are these things? What did that say? A neck? A neck. Or is it a neek? Neek. That probably sounds cooler. Dude, don't run. Because I can't keep up. Come on. Where are you going, bro? My neek. Alright. Wet. 57. 50. Whoa, that's cool looking. And it looks like the forest changes over there. Alright, let's see what this says. Whoa, you get away from me. Okay, no, seriously? This land is hard and wild, but... Oh, it's just saying that again. Alright. So, let's try this. Now, how do you... Quiet, go to the quietly and let them eat your stock. Oh, they need roots. Is that what it said? Roots of the ground of their pleasure. And I don't have any roots, so that ain't happening. Can I tear this down? Give me some wood, dude. I guess you could fix it up. I wasn't thinking about that, but I'm not gonna stay here. Let's take all this wood, man. Jump skill improved. This has me curious to see what the... Because this dude's not jumping at all. What is that? Yeah, hopefully the higher levels 
Obviously the skill improves, but I'm wondering if it gets like almost outlandish, like you're like jumping over <laughs> like buildings like this. Alright, how much am I carrying? How much wood do I have? Tearing it down. Well, that skill's got to be improving at this point. Clubs. Wood cutting axe. Do I even have access to an axe? No. Alright, I think I'm good for now. Let's go... Swim across... head back see if I can find a good spot to start out because whoa and is this a wait is this a circle no don't don't do that gained off ping all right I'm gonna wait right here I'm gonna fill up your stamina all right let's try this See if you don't die. There's a building up ahead, too. Alright. Didn't die. And do I have a, uh, an improvement in health here? Wasn't it 25 before? Now it's going up? Looks like it's 30 is the cap? Or maybe it was before, I just wasn't paying attention. All right, here we go. Let's see what this building is. This looks kind of cool. My guy's already kind of getting faster. Get some dandelions. All right. Yeah, this is all types of run down looking. I'm gonna blow through this hammer quick. All right, let's see what this stone says. Or is that what I need to do first? Do I need to tame a, there we go. All right, this is different. Hold traveler and bear witness to my warning. Where many who have come before you carried here by Odin's will to do his work. The path ahead is hard and dangers great. If you hold your Life dear, keep to these meadows and make your dwelling away from the trees. Fear the horned one and spare his skin. Okay. Whoa, what was that? Okay, so yeah, the first guy is in the trees somewhere. And it's about to get dark. That looks cool. So we need to make our spot away from this, from the trees. Kind of want to be close to water though. What is this? That way I can improve my swimming skills. All right, let's head this way. Let's see if we can find something interesting down here. Running seven. All right. Where is water, dude? Whoa, this map is way bigger than I thought. Okay. Here. Gained off ping. All right, we're heading this way. It's a big old tree. Kind of like this forest area, the change. 
that wood here. And so far in these little shack deals, I'm not finding anything. What is this? Open door. Oh, there we go. Okay. You... Whoa. When the temperature drops at night, or if you are wet, you will suffer from being cold. This reduces your stamina regeneration. She seeking shelter by open flames is your best option when this happens. Dang, I keep pressing exit to exit. <laughs> the conversation. Don't need to do that. All right. Uh-oh. I just heard... Uh, I don't know what this is. What is going on? I bring tidings. What is that? Oh, snaps. Let's get some, dude. Can I hit this dude? Let me... Why is he stuck? Where are you going? You have wandered into the Black Forest. This place can be very dangerous for those unprepared for it. Prove your worth by slaying whatever that thing is. Yeah, I'm doing zero damage, so I don't think I'm ready for that. I'm going to come back to you, guy. Oh. Where are you going, friend? There you go. Oh, let's craft another one. Or can I just repair this? Hold on. Can you? What about now? Ah, it's not showing anything on it. Huh, nope. Okay. Ooh, what are these glowing things? What is that? Thistle. Nice. Okay. Still nothing... Good. Now I'm running faster. Keep away, boar. Okay. Map. Okay, I'm kind of close. Ping. There we go. Before we do that, what is this? It's just like a lookout thing. To not show the the ping right there. There it is. Oh, come get some, dude. Whoa. 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 What is going on? Why are they running around in weird circles? Oh, that guy's a special one. They're like not, not fighting me? Alright, just regenerate stamina. There you go. Wait, why are you... Mouse 2 is block. Whoa, there we go. Now he threw something at me. Dude, stay... <laughs> stay put, <laughs> you guys. Like trying to round up dogs. 
There's another one. Get back here. There's a lot more. Hit him. There we go. Hit him. Are you trying to throw stuff at me, bro? Oh, there's two of them now. Ooh. 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 Now they finally got me. Dang it. Alright, so what happens after this? Is all my stuff gone? Yeah. So how does that work? Each time you are struck down, you will forget a small part of your abilities and drop your belongings at the site of the accident. If you wish you were home by now, I'd recommend building a bed wherever home may be. Whoa. Just punch you out of the air, dude. Well, now we're gonna go get our stuff. There it is. Give me my stuff. Items recovered. Thank you. Necktail. Okay. Map. Here. Well, this doesn't look like a good spot to build a base. And I'm across from where I was trying to swim. <laughs> Alright, what is this saying? Let all who read me be aware of the gray dwarfs, the sk skulkers in darkness, the soulless ones. They are born from rot and rainfall. They spring like mushrooms from the smoking soil. There is nothing on their tongues or behind their eyes. Those who fear nothing should still fear them. When the soul of a murderer or a great sinner rots under the ground, it makes a hollow cyst which draws rock and wood and moss to it. It gathers up the peat into flesh braids reeds into bone and takes rags of skin. It should not walk, but when the night comes, it walks. Should you who read this see one with a sword to your hand, lance it and let it out, or put it to the torch, for it fears the flame. Okay, so it fears flame. Uh, keep doing that still. And yeah, this isn't looking like a good spot to build a base. What's that? Ooh, blueberries. Alright, we're going to run back, because I don't think I can really build a good base here. <laughs> what is that noise? Yeah, we'll, we'll cut back so I can actually find a good spot to build a base. Alright, don't worry, I did die again. I had to go pick up my stuff. But I'm thinking the reason I can't build anything is I don't have a hammer. So I'm wondering if this unlocks that for us. There it is. All right. With this tool, you will raise mighty halls and towering fortifications. Start by building a workbench. This in turn will enable you to construct other things. Okay, so. That's there, that's those stones here. I'm thinking I just build something, whoa, here to start because we're close to the water. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What is this? Oh, this is rock. Just shiny rock. Okay. Tab. You. Go there. Three. Repair. Campfire. Whoa. Crafting. Workbench. Aha. Let's see what this dude has to say now. Oh, Bo. There we go. Okay, tab, tab, where you at dude? Oh, give me a bunch of stuff. Any minute now. Whoa. So don't push the middle, <laughs> the middle button because she'll just smash it. All right, uh, let's try that again, I guess. Building furniture. E skips through it. Tab to exit. 
Okay. I bring tidings. Yes. I'm trying to talk to you. Why is it just saying one? Workbench does not need repairs. Because I'm holding that? There we go. The workbench allows you to craft complex items as well as giving you access to lots of more building pieces to construct with the hammer. Okay. Thank you. Alright, now let's go three, one, too far. Use workbench. Crafting station needs a roof. Oh, what? Well, let's try this again. Floor. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Crafting furniture, miscellaneous. No, crafting wood floor, wood floor two by two. Wood wall, wood half wall. How do you shift, toggle, snapping options, rotate, okay. Let's see if this gives me, yeah, it does. Okay. E, E. Okay. Just to see, can't do anything with that. Okay. So let us build I mean, this is about as good a spot as any until I f figure out the what I want to do. Okay, so three here, building. What's going on with this? Workbench, oh, okay. So you have to have the workbench in order to do that. So I'll just put you anywhere from now. And then shift, or not shift, just rotate, right? All right, tell you what, we're gonna build it over this little pond looking area. I'm gonna put you right there. Oh, are you gonna snap too? There it is. How much wood do I have? Not nearly enough. Or is it even showing me how much wood I have? All right, we're gonna start there. So now, build some floors. That's what's up, without getting stuck. And you can't jump high enough. All right, I think I kind of got it figured out. So. Exit. Maybe. <laughs> Tab. So, I just need to switch that. There we go. There it is. Alright, so I'm going to build this out. We're going to jump ahead, and I'm going to have something built here that we can look at, and then we'll finish out the video with that. Alright, I thought this was cool, so quick snippet on just building. I, I'm not even further along in building, actually. But I chopped down this tree that was right next to where I'm at. It splits into huge log pieces and then you break those down further until you finally get the wood out of that so interesting with how they were going to do that I, I was curious to see if i thought it would just spell on wood no you have to do multiple sections of it so all right not done yet and this is really just going to be like a starting point because i'm going to find a better location as i play more but i put the bed down and this guy's uh gonna tell us something bed needs a roof Sleep the night away in your bed and awaken feeling refreshed and full of energy. Another improvement to your home would be some chests where you can store items. It is good practice to always have some spare equipment if something unfortunate should happen while exploring. Yeah, so you want duplicates after dying multiple times. So, a couple things I've noticed. Uh, one, you can gather flint along the riverbed here, using that for the fire. Uh, I don't know how to repair these items yet. So I need to get the roof on this thing. And then we can, I don't have enough for chests either. What do I need for that? 10 wood, I don't have 10 wood. 
and then roof. Thatch roof. Wood. Whoa, I need to finish my walls. So we're gonna get the walls built. Yeah, missing items. You gotta gather a lot of wood. But I'm gonna do that. And then, uh... And the other thing is, I don't know if I'm building this... The look of it backwards. Is the smooth supposed to be on the outside? <laughs> I think that's how it's supposed to be, and I'm building it backwards. I don't care. Like I said, this is in our permanent spot, so... We'll have the smooth on the inside. Kind of looks off, though. But oh well. So we need to collect more wood. I'll get the roof on, and then we'll see what happens when we, when we move the workbench inside. All right, so we're all set up. This is a horrible setup, but <laughs> we're set up. So I have the bed in here. I have the chopping block. I have storage. So I put some stuff in the chest here. I still don't know how to repair items, so I'm hoping I can figure that out. Uh, I think I might have to move this too. Because I don't think that's working. So I had the workbench in there. It said it didn't have a roof on it, so I just built this little hut. So let's maybe add that there. Looks like it's an extension of that or feeding off of it. So, this does work now. Okay. Repair an item. Ah, oh, there we go. So you need the workbench to do that. Done. All right. <laughs> Ho, farmer's tool for working the earth. That's what she said. Uh, upgrade, stone ax. Quality to number two, there we go. So I'm gonna hide that stuff in chests. This will all be on the next video, though. So, wood shield, boom. Leather scraps. Thought I had leather. I think I put those up. Rag tunics. Rag pants. Flint axe. Ooh, I do have flint. Or I think I used all of it. Sharper than stone. Crude bow. So, the next video is gonna... Ooh, style. That's what's up. There you go. Can I change the style of this? Wood shield door. Nice. What about the weapons? No. Okay, so the next video is going to be about doing that. On the in-between, I'm probably going to move. <laughs> I may explore, find a better area, because this was just to get this going without spending forever trying to find a good starting location. Uh, and if I can't find anything, I may just move across <laughs> to the area I said I was going to build a base. Because uh, once you get the ship, then you should be good to go. Because you can make that... Where is it? Right there. Raft. Sorry. And you can start traveling around. But, not going to mess with that right now. So, that's going to be it for this one. Uh, let me know what you guys think. This game was only $20. And I definitely see the appeal with the game. There's a lot that you can do. I haven't even battled outside of the handful of creatures I did in this video. I mean, there's bosses that you're going to fight and all of that. They just unveiled the roadmap and the next one's going to be for base building. And then after that, it's like the wolf's den or something, the wolf pack or something like that. And that's going to be with bosses and creatures. Um, they got a couple more planned out after that. But let me know what you guys think. Is this a game that you play and you really like it or just based off the videos that you've seen, is this a game that you're thinking about picking up? Let me know in the comment section. So that's going to be it for this one, everybody. If you like the video, hit the like button for me. If you want to continue to follow along with all my content, hit the subscribe button for me. Thanks so much for watching.